Hello, everybody. Welcome to a little journey into the world of Telltale Games. Ooh, what and other Telltale? Weird proper and other weird properties and huge sponsors of their company and whatever. Anyway, welcome, everybody, to a look at a Poker Night at the Inventory. Oh, yeah. I, I hate poker. <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of poker either, but this game actually is pretty fun and recording all this. I, I had to, like, get sort of good at poker and... I enjoy, I have I enjoy no... it pretty well. I'm terrible at poker, but I love the interactions. Oh yeah, that's what this that's what sold this game for what me. What the well. and the second one. Oh. Ooh. Apparently it was a little misdirection. So there is a bit of a lore like background to this whole game, so and, and we'll be meeting a character who will help explain some more. Basically there was a big old like um prohibition on there was going there was almost going to be a big prohibition on games. And so the, an owner of this club decided to make a secret, like, under-the-counter gaming institution, just in case that was going to happen. And so we have this very illustrious club in Winslow from hey Tales of. Hey there, Mr. Winslow. Whoop. Tales of Monkey Island, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Another, we'll be getting to that later. Don't worry. Don't, yeah. don't you worry. Yeah. How good it is to see a fresh He's face the here owner of this establishment. I imagine you're here also, for the we've gone to bigger and better things since the, since the Tales Let games. Yeah, for yeah. Tales games. Also, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Also, uh, I'm not gonna I... lie. I love that they. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say. Uh, I think hype mentioned, but the characters we're gonna see hanging out here are randomized. I'm a bit more familiar. Yeah, they are, because I know there's like just to get out of the way. Um, sometimes you'll see Sam in the crowd. Other times you'll see other characters from Sam and Max, or from also a spoiler from Strong Bad School Game for Attractive People. But yeah, it's all randomized. Yeah. Those are two characters from seasons two. You'll see them the later. World -renowned determination and productivity Another character the American too. Oh, and oh, we, we could talk about we could talk about Flint because he was in the comics. Oh, yeah, so Flint. Oh, pom -pom. Hello, Pom Pom, wherever you are. Just in case. Oh, you need oh he's another Rome Store character. Oh, and there's the board from Strong Bad Together Three. So welcome. Yeah. And enjoy yourself. So let's go meet ah, your our players. Yeesh, what a varied cast. Mm-hmm. I hope there is room at the table for a fifth. Ha! <laughs> Fresh meat. Hey, Max. <laughs> Max. So, yep, Max is, has returned. I love the little pause. Like, I know it's meant for loading, but I love the little pause there. It's almost like it's like, hmm, wait a minute, do I really want to play with these guys? I was, oh, I was thinking more like the guys like fresh meat, and the guys like, yeah, cool, stop. Did that rabbit just talk? Wait, what? Wait, that's a rabbit? I hope each of you brought rabbit thingy. Anyway. Ten thousand dollars in cash, right there. Here it's a flop. Jump change, I say. Jump Apparently, they're all the die has been cast. freaking ripped in cash. The game will be no yeah. How did, how and also, um, I, will I was about to say something that they didn't do in this one, but it kind of happens every now and then. Sometimes one of the characters will not have the money to bid, and sometimes they'll actually bid like a personal item of theirs. Like for example, I think Max will bid his gun, and Strong Bad will bid like. Yeah. I don't know what he bids, but yeah, they all bid like a personal item. And if you beat them in the game, you can actually keep the item. And I think in some of them, you can also use in Team Fortress too. Yeah, like in the box. Like for instance, as you notice, the heavy he will actually bet Sasha. Why would you <laughs> bet your own babe? I don't know. But anyway, so there, so there's a lot of rules. I can explain as we go. And if you never played poker, I'll try my best to explain it. I'm not the best at it. But yeah, as you see, we're playing against Max from Telltale Sam and Max, Strong Bad from the Cool Game for Attractive People. The Heavy, because Steam helped put this on, I guess, whatever, from Team Fortress 2. And I can only imagine, because they put the most money into T Telltale Games' pockets, help sponsor everything, Tyco from Penny Arcade. Voiced by not Tyco. Oh. But yeah. actually, if I'm correct, he's voiced by the original voice actor of Max. Oh, um, really? Yeah, Andrew Chicken. Yep, from the episode one of, uh, of our little look at commentary earlier. How, par how paradoxical must that feel? I mm -hmm. don't know, and I'm honestly, I'm, I'm honestly impressed they didn't make any clever the flop. quip between the two of them. Yeah, and uh, nice, nice imagery there, game. Yeah. <laughs> so okay, so there's, so the way this works is that there are phases to every round, quote unquote, of poker, where you look at the cards, you look at the two in your hands, you bet because you're trying to make the best. Basically, um, if you ever never played poker, you're trying to make the best hand, whether it be a straight flush, two of a pair, three of a kind. Two pairs, full house, all that kind of crap. And uh -huh. they usually have a little chart if you want to check to see what beats what. Um, 
Satisfaction. Collect your winnings with dapper consonant, confidence or sure-headed elegance, whichever you prefer. <laughs> so, let's look at my first hand. Two of clubs and a queen of diamonds. Mm-hmm. And uh, also the blinds. Ah, okay, I the blind. Oh, okay, man. <laughs> And, um, I am going to play this So I, I may not be able to talk well, too much, but probably. as you see, a lot of the big part of this game is the interactions between this amazingly weirded, weird cast of characters. Also, I folded because I didn't like my hand at all. That's fair, fair enough. But I'll, let, Check disc. Always play but, I'll leave it, but I'll leave it playing for now to see some interactions. Mm -hmm. All things okay, considered, I'm that checking. really is like the big highlight of the game. Just seeing the interaction between all these characters, though. Just jumping the gun here. I do prefer what they do with two than they do here. And we'll be getting to that one too. So. And Tycho's out. Aww. And mm -hmm. as you see, we have ten thousand dollars each. Spoilers: If you pay attention to the money, you're gonna see what I tried to do to keep this from looking good. <laughs> but um, Logan cheated. Ooh. No, it's standard issue since 1998. Yep, that's when the, no the comic started. I can't I've got see a motorcycle anything helmet that, that gives me 100% dying thing. I know. Searing UV rays. This sounds beneficial, especially for my skin. Okay, fine. We'll mm -hmm. fine. But deal next hand. Thank you. The blinds are basically like that's when you're forced to bid, so it's to keep the game going, so that you know you're. It's to discourage not playing, because otherwise you will be losing money I eventually because of those blinds. Yeah. Also, something okay, we should so dwell on is that each of all the characters, yeah, um, just to, uh, all the characters each have their own, like, very different types of playstyles. Like, for example, Max tends to be the most random of the two. Strong Bad tends to bluff a lot. Um, Tycho, um, I, I don't remember what Tycho and Heavies are, to be honest. All these aces reminds the me Heavy, of um, where I could use the Heavy loves to, the mind. Heavy is very easy to, like, goad him into a bidding you war. Ever have any weird dreams, Even, it's the kind of thing of, like, if he, he'll, he'll like, killed. maybe he'll, oh, hang there on. Is blood everywhere. He's dreaming of being killed. What? Ooh. But I wake up and I realize Tycho this knows the thing. Nobody can kill Heavy Weapons guy. <laughs> Right. right. I'm sure snipers never got to you. Thank you, Max. <laughs> they sometimes have fun, yeah. So right now it's between me and Max, and he's random. Let's see what I got. I'm gonna bet. I like one. I have a three, four, five. I have two fives. I like this. I like my bot. I like right. my odds in this one. Well, let's try it. Call it. King and nine. Max has ace, ace high. high. I have a pair. A pair of fives. So Ooh, I win. Wins the hand. Yay. Woo! Did that sound like I care? Oh, shush. Sure, sure. <laughs> So, yeah, ace high is like if you don't have anything, it just goes down to what higher card you have. What sort of caliber are we talking? Big. Like <laughs> what? Are we talking three hundred Weatherby mag here? Bigger. That's a big. That's a big. Cal, you see the bullets around his chest? They're pretty big. Bigger yeah, seriously. Yeah, they, they can they practically fit your ear. Depending on what size ear you have. Why is oh, look at the title here. Enemy cannot use ammunition. But Sasha can chew through there. Nice. Diabolical. I think so. <laughs> so yeah, it's just fun seeing how they like get along kind of. No okay, sorry, so back to the other things. Is that uh, keep Heavy so um even if he like may later. even if he has a worse hand than you, you can get him into a bidding war and he, he gets I guess they described it as he gets very emotional. Ah. Where, where where he like he 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 thinks that like as his pride he will sure. not want to back down even if you have a totally better hand like look at this I have two I have two queens I'm betting you have yeah. a pair and yeah it's yours he can oh, he, he can never burn he can never turn down an ego stroking yeah, contest well yep. thanks for proving my point wrong by just folding yeah he, yeah you can do that it's a big ego thing and Tycho is pretty much the the calm quiet veteran <laughs> yeah he's usually like your hardest target makes sense I mean. He seems the most level-headed compared to the rest of them. Actually, smell like detritus. Oh, Mr. Weapons, <laughs> I'm in the market for a new firearm. Oh dear. Uh oh. Something classy and understated to supplement my daily driving. Yeah. Oh God. For you, I would not recommend minigun then. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. Hysterical to see you try and hold it no. though. There is this fast Ooh. baby man who annoys me greatly with shot. Oh, the scout. The heavy wins the hand. <laughs> oh, heavy one. Oh. strategy when fighting heavy weapons guy is not to fight heavy weapons right. guy. Okay. Also, just in terms of chemistry, oh, yeah. the... the no, there is this fast baby man who annoys me greatly with shot. Yeah, we'll usually sometimes oh, resume this discussion. Offspring for leather. Huh? Ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. 
force of nature. I'll head down to the dealership tomorrow and tell them heavy weapons guy sent me. There is no need. I know guy. Okay. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> also, guy. yeah, just to go in... Yeah, just to go into chemistry real quick. Um, Max, for obvious reasons, is completely enamored with Heavy Weapon Sky just because of, you know, look at what he does in the games. Um, Tycho and Strong Bad kind of have a bit of a bickering relationship. Like, they love to, like, peck at each other. Well, because they, they both like classic games of some sort or another, whether they be fictitious in Strong Bad's case or well, not, not fictitious in Tycho's. And Heavy Weapon Sky just... Check this. I don't know. He's just like a hey, weird, uh, innocent, a violent dude. Like oh. Weird, innocent, violent guy. dude. Oh, okay. I'll take that. We'll try not to rough you up too bad. Also, I'm Max and Strong Bad are just two competing I egos. A strong bad school game for a yeah. People source code from those Telltale shops. Oh, he's also apparently stealing code from Telltale. Ooh, that sounds huh? good. Oh yeah, that's actually a reference. That's actually a reference to a lot of the promo videos oh, that they yeah. made for Cool Game for Attractive People. Pitch. Got the code over to nice. my boys I'm gonna be playing that on the Wii actually. The it's really like fun. Like, like, yeah, um, I and will say one. I think it's a lot of fun. Ooh, Whether you think it's fun really kind of depends on what you think of Homestar processes. Runner in general. Because a so lot of the know, humor it, from oh. it. I was about to say also, a lot of the humor and it does. Sorry. I was say if you notice real quick, I have a King Queen Jack Ace. So I have a pretty good flush. Oh, he went all in. Uh oh. Oh boy. Yeah. It is not advisable. Dude, no. I got a flush. Go. Flush him out. We have. Or maybe not a flush. I think it's a straight. I always get those two mixed up. Let's see. So he has two fours, and I have a three. Okay. And their reactions will change as they see how it works. And in the second game, they yeah. even have statistics, which are helpful. Oh, yep. The player has a straight. A straight. There you go. Yes. Lovely. And you have only one pair. Worthless cards. I like your strategy. The pair <laughs> I won. The I lose. I do not understand this burning I feel. It's called this. It's called defeat. Oh. I am defeated. This reminds me of famous song from Motherland. Really? Ooh. Oh you must God. know when to hold on to your cards, and you must know when to burn them in fire. Because if you lose, you bring insufferable shame to Republic and are sent to a work camp in Forest. How wow. poetic. And kind of uncomfortable. <laughs> the blind and off he goes. Okay, so, and uh, after so many rounds, the uh, the blinds do increase. So yeah, got to keep playing. Although, I'll, now well, I'm just going to start skipping around now that you've seen how this works. Close you and your licensing agreement. Yeah, Sam and I just focus on fighting. Yeah, so just keep an eye on who's betting and our exploits for decades. Be entertained by some uh, little oh, bantering here and there. And meanwhile, the heavy is drinking his sorrows away at the bar. Charm and charm yeah, he's the the just glaring at me, probably. He's, <laughs> he's off. He's going to be off for my number when, if I ever decide to play TF2. If I ever decide to play TF2. Actually, a little bit of a question that I kind of want to ask. Should we go ahead? Yeah. Actually, hold that thought. I'll be right back. Okay. We're being exploited. So, also, as you see, Strongbed is very much keen on the fourth Ooh, wall, while Max just thinks Santa he's Claus crazy and loves that craziness. Let's go a little bit further. So, wait, this, I assume this game came out after, like, season three of Sam and Max? I think? Because I remember, I just noticed that Sam, uh, Max said something about something akin to that. But... Okay, good. You didn't pay too much attention to that. It won't be a spoiler to you then. Yay. Okay. Let me look up. Let me look up. Uh, let me look up Poker Night Inventory One. See when that came like out. Like snake box of six. Now the snakes have fists too. <gasps> snakes with snakes fists. That's threat. gonna be a hell of an apocalypse. That's the point. Yeah, that would make the snakes a little more I'm challenging. All, all right, so now here we go. Straw about to go all in, and Tycho is raising him. Oh. So let's see if I can. If I was capable of lucid frustration, I'd take the dealer out into the alley and give him what for. And Max is out. So let's see who wins. Okay, I have Sorry two about sevens. that family issue. Check. Let's see the next card. It's okay. So Stromba just went all in. Ooh boy. So this definitely won't come back to buy him in his I'll little box around, around. gentlemen. So regardless of what happens, I'm gonna see if Tycho and I can get rid of him. Check. I'm hmm. betting. Oh, he's betting. Oh boy. Ah, uh, calling, I guess. The player has two, two pairs. Oh, should I? Okay. Should I wait till those hands over before I ask what I was gonna ask? Sure. Yeah. So even though I have two pairs, Tycho has a higher pair. Rats. He's queens. I have sevens. 
No. Tycho. And so Tycho wins both pots. I think it would get tiring winning all these pots. So Tycho wins both pots and Strong Bad's eliminated. Very tiring hearing about it. <laughs> Strong Bad has been and eliminated. True to form, he doesn't take the loss that well. I'm blowing this pop stinkle stab. Pop stinkle. Lines are now three hundred. Now it's down to Max and Tycho, and Tycho has more money than all of us combined. Max wins. Rats. This will be yeah. interesting. This reminds me of a story about a rabbit and his ostentatious bank account. Eh, but actually, Max won a pair. <laughs> oh, yeah. Max. Good on him. Like being a freelance police officer. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, don't take that out of context. I bet it is. Also, yeah, I just oh, looked up. Uh, I season three I'm came out actually in the exact same year as this game did. Oh. They're developed at the same time. You know okay. This is why I think we get along. You're a renaissance man. You need anybody roughed up? There's a bird at the pet store that's been giving me a little beef, yeah. Oh, putting a wiseacre in his place is my specialty. Nice. <laughs> we, can discuss, we can discuss this later. And Strong yeah, Bad's at the arcade. Reminds me of the time <laughs> a oh, yeah, he's, play, he's playing on, uh, what's his name? Oh, Bluster Blaster. Yeah, Bluster, that's it. East River. Ugh. Hippos. Stop playing with my joystick! But yeah, the question I was actually asking earlier is... Wait, hang on, wait, hang on, wait. What? Huh? You know what I'm talking about. All this. Those slender necks. Huh? What? So huh? Long and muscular. Max is worried. So wrap your arms around him. When Max is the one freaked out, you know something's wrong. Just to see what it feels like. What? <laughs> just want to get up there and sway in the fucking wind. <gasps> no? Is that not... Okay. Also, yeah, he is a potty mouth. Yeah. There is yeah, a... Yeah, Sluster Blaster. Yeah, and I was about to say, the game does have, like, a little um, swear filter, but it's so, Tycho's the only one that really, really utilizes it. Ah, that's fair. Yeah, we can handle it. I mean, I mean, heck, I was, I mean, heck, I was living with a sailor for years. I think Strong, uh, oh, and actually something interesting, Strong Bad actually does cuss, but his is always censored, I think, because they literally just didn't want to cuss as Strong Bad's voice. That's fair, I mean, technically, uh, technically that show, that, that series is made for, uh, like, younger teens, isn't it? Really? Yeah. I never went to college. Thank you, Max, for that elucidating speech. Like, if it was, if it was actually on TV, it'd probably be like, what, TV 14? Yeah. I assume so. But yeah, uh, going back to what I was asking, while we still have time left in the video, should we take the time to kind of delve into our, like, individual history with, like, each of these different, like, properties? Like, like you know, me and Logan Checking. talk about Sam and Max quite a bit, so I think we don't have to dwell too much on that. But how about things like with Team Fortress hey. 2 or Homestar Runner or even Penny Arcade? I'll call your micro wager. Played a little bit of Team Fortress 2. It was probably, I think, the weakest title on the orange box on Xbox 360 since everyone was playing PC. Okay. Penny Arcade, I actually am still in the middle of reading one of their uh, okay, web comic books, but I don't really think they do much else besides that. Nope. And Tycho's folded, so it's between me and Max. Interesting. Let's see if I can call him out. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh. Yeah, we have two pairs, and I have a high king. I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm betting. See let's you. take, let's take this asshole to court. I told, wait, what's the word? For his weird, weird obsession with strangling kids? people. That's oh, all in. He's going yeah, all that, in. I do that. Oh, all right, call it. The player has. I don't know why I love king. that. Like, I fold. No wait, what's it actually called? All in. Has I'll do that instead. The and he has two pair, but his higher card is a ten. What are those the numbers on the cards mean? Woo! And he had no idea what he was doing. Max has been eliminated from play. Oh no! Next time I'll rethink my strategy of bet every time my belly button itches. Probably the best. Yeah. Goodbye, Do Max. And with that, and with that, Max literally spent their entire, uh, spent their entire um, monthly no, rent. salary for the yeah. Well, down to me and Tycho. <laughs> Spoilers. It kind of went back and forth a lot, and yeah. Then I finally, jeez, and now it was finally between me and him. I kind of had to use an engine code to sort of help me get to this because I didn't want to just lose at the end. <laughs> but let it be known, I'm pretty good at this game still. Just Tycho plays very ruthlessly. Sad thing is, is like at this point, at this point, you kind of this game kind of loses a bit of the charm because again, like the big highlight is the interaction between all the other characters. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Haiku has ace high. By this point, it's really just if you really like poker in general. Pair of queens. The pair of queens, I the win! The Woo! Hand. Good hand. Yay. The player wins the tournament. GG, what do you say you and I roll out, stop by the OG, your treat, and then drop the rest of that money on some new procs? They got the spinners on there now. Oh, snap. Tight. Let's go. Let's go. I want to play that new Wolfenstein game. Nerd. <laughs> and with that, I won the tournament. And you got, a, you got the, the max in table. table. Yep, that's another thing. Uh, every it says next deck and two wins. So yeah, basically uh, you can get you can 
win new uh, prizes, little custom thingies. Again, you can earn uh, all their sorts of like all their like items and things. It's a really fun game. Basically, I think it was a very smart decision that Telltale decided to take. Because bear in mind, the last like original original game they made was like a poker game that had Leonard Snake Charmer, and that didn't turn out well. I'm glad they didn't want to give up on that. And they instead found a really nice like. Almost like an Adult Swim like crossover thing. I really like that. I like. Speaking of Adult Swim movies. crossovers, next time we next time we'll do Poker Night Two, where we literally get to fight against an Adult Swim star. Yep. <clears throat> ah, voice cracked. Yep, I'm a big boy <laughs> who plays poker on games with gamers. Mm-hmm. On Any that last note. words, hype. Uh, Sam, I have something I need to tell you. What's that, Max? I might have bet all of our money and lost it to that guy from the Penny Arcades. Oh, Max, don't you... worry. Oh, oh, don't worry. I already swapped our entire salary winnings with... Uh, oh, oh, it's not... Ah! Missed up the joke. Don't worry. I already swapped our rent salary with your with your life insurance plane payment. So you should be totally fine. Oh, boy. <laughs> Bye-bye, everybody. Until next time, everybody. Bye, everybody. You're gonna have to play in my place, you know that, Sam? Yes, I know.